welcome to the ill blur. Madding, sugar, and it do. Oh, yeah. Welcome back to ill blur. Maddie, what is going on, guys? Welcome back to my returning subscribers. Thank you so much for returning and supporting, commenting, liking. It is gladly appreciated. Thanks for being a part of the ill family. Also, new subscribers, welcome to the ill family. If you're interested in this type of content, please hit that subscribe button and join the community of the ill family. Let's get right into it. <laughs> so originally, um, you know, this is interesting. A lot of people don't know, but the Snyderverse, remember the, the Snyderverse that they were talking about restoring and everything? And it's interesting now, I just found out recently that the Snyderverse <laughs> had help. And I mean, not just the mainstream DC fans, but help from bots and fake accounts. How, Sway? How, Sway? How? <laughs> it's crazy, right? Um, I guess the Snyderverse pushed because let's be honest, um, DC was not going to give this man another chance to uh, put out a full-fledged film because let's be honest, the first Justice League movie that came out in 2017 was not a complete film by Zack Snyder. Some of the film was Zack Snyder. Some of the film was Josh Whedon. I felt like the film just didn't live up to the hype or the expectations of DC and even the DC fan like I am, you know? Um, it was not well received. There were a lot of missed reviews about it. And, you know, what can you do when the director has to give the film to a whole different director? So, you know, and I felt like literally when I said, I was like, dang, man, they really did that. They really said, yo, man, this man had a family of mercy. The only reason why Zack Snyder did not finish the film because of a family of mercy. DC let him go. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? So, Fans <laughs> and fake fans and bots <laughs> decided to say, yo, we're going to push Restore the Snyderverse. Successfully, it did work. <laughs> Despite most of the fans being the people that pushed it. You know, there were fake accounts, which are kind of strange, and bots. Um, I was like, man, it shows you how powerful social media is. I was like, dang, like, <laughs> we got the bots? <laughs> we got fake accounts? <laughs> you know, it's very interesting. On Twitter, pushing this agenda, um, I mean, it worked out. I mean, even though it was only a 13% of <laughs> fake bots, <laughs> and you know what I'm saying, well, bots, excuse me, and fake accounts, very interesting that that worked out in the favor because we eventually got a solid release. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? For pretty much the Snyder's Cut, which came out in 2021. Now, let's talk about that. Um, it definitely worked out. Uh, we got a full-fledged film. Um, the film, <laughs> literally, to me, it felt like a better film overall. We got enough of the flash in the film. <laughs> Excuse me. We got enough of Batman, Wonder Woman, Aquaman, you know what I'm saying, Cyborg. Um, I felt like the film flowed really well. Um, you know, there were still problems <laughs> that, you know, the fans had learned about. And literally what happened was literally, um, to some degree, literally I said to myself, I was like, dang, that really happened. Um, they did not, the, the Snyder movie did extremely well on HBO Max, but the problem was <laughs> HBO Max, um, uh, didn't want that to happen. <laughs> DC didn't want that to happen on HBO Max. I'm like, it's successfully streaming. It's a big DC film <laughs> that y'all asked for. And now you guys are kind of like, oh no, <laughs> we, we don't want this to stay on the platform. How? How, Sway? Like, really? I was like, oh my God, like DC, what are y'all doing? And now it's shockingly that it's back <laughs> on uh, a streaming platform. You know what I'm saying? And it sucks because that Snyder situation, like, they didn't want that film to get released. <laughs> they didn't want it to, they didn't want it to promote it or none of that stuff. And I'm like, dang, man. Like to be at a company where you can't promote your own film <clears throat> and they didn't want the film to ever be released is terrible. You know what I'm saying? But it shows you how powerful social media is because <laughs> if it wasn't for the, the majority fans 
the bots also, and we can't, we got to include the fake accounts. Um, we would have never gotten this solid film. Now, this what needs to happen. <laughs> if they could, they need to let him work on the second film. If there's a way the fans <laughs> can push this agenda through, I mean, it'd be great if the fake accounts can become solid accounts and literally support in the bots too. Um, but you know how it is, man. <laughs> People have their reasons why they, they do the things they do on, on social media. Um, but it shows you how powerful it is, man. It's a powerful tool. We also saw that with Sonic to some degree where it really worked out. <laughs> we were upset with how Sonic looked. We like, hey, hey, hey. We, we went straight to social media and said, hey, we don't like the Sega. I, 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 I. <laughs> so hopefully uh, the fans can definitely uh, come back and literally say, you know what? <laughs> uh, we don't want nobody else to direct this film for the sequel, because if we, they do the sequel, it's not going to work out the way it's supposed to, because don't get me wrong, we love, you know what I'm saying, you know, there's nothing wrong with other directors, but we would prefer the person that brought the movie into the success it was and how it was built off. But you guys tell me in the comments, what do you think about this? Do you agree with me on this? Uh, you know, is it interesting that uh, we have fake accounts supporting Zack Snyder Restore the Snyderverse? Also, bots, <laughs> and also, if they did literally a second Justice League film, would you like to see the director return? It's your boy, Ill Blur Matter, guys. Thanks for supporting. Thanks for commenting. Thanks for locking me into this time. Have a great one, guys. I'm out. <laughs> if you made it to the end of the video, you are the real MVP. <laughs>